So all of our RVs are Winnebago Views 24J models. As we keep, give you a quick tour, you'll see all the amenities it has to offer. All right, let's do a quick walk around and see what some of these storage compartments are. Here we have a storage for your freshwater hose. This is also a good compartment for any wet storage that you might have. You don't have to worry about bringing your own hose. You can hook these up to any hookup station. So this is one of my favorite compartments. It's the biggest, it fits the most items. It's perfect for a larger group or family. It fits many different sizes of luggage. It's also accessible from the inside, which is very important. So if you need to access any of this while you're driving, it's very simple. It's very roomy. We often put chairs, duffel bags, suitcases in there, anything that you might need for your trip. This little guy right here is your fresh water fill. There's a couple areas and we'll show you later where else to fill, but this is your gravity fill. So please be aware that when you're using the hot water heater or the furnace, these two vents here get very hot. So please be careful not to touch or place any items that may melt against these vents. In here. This is our onboard generator. It's a LP generator, which means it runs off propane. We have separate tanks and we'll show you where to fill those. But generator, you can run, you can boondock, you can dry camp, you can run your AC, you can run all electrical off of this. Here we have another compartment, large. We often put chairs or whatever else here. One more thing we should probably mention is that these all lock and the keys are on the key ring, right? Yep. All right. All right I'm gonna tell you a little bit about the engine. So these are, as we said, Winnebago views on Mercedes-Benz Sprinter chassis. So it's a V6 powerful engine, diesel. Um, one quick thing to know, a lot of people ask us, where is the diesel tank? So. Our panel is right here behind the door. You open the door, there's a little panel right here, and this is where your diesel is. Also, we talked about the onboard generator that runs off propane. Also, some of the other amenities run off propane, and the fill is right here, located right here. You just pull up to whatever propane station, you pull down the lever, open it up, and the attendant will fill it up for you. There's nothing else you need to do. All right, we'll keep going with some more storage. Here we have two uh, more compartments. We provide our renters with four camping chairs for each trip. Here we have leveling blocks. If you are camping at a site that might not be particularly level, these are helpful. Uh, this storage compartment is actually one long one. This side fits a small carry-on type luggage, but if you have skis or a snowboard, this is ideal for that. Unfortunately, it doesn't quite fit a surfboard, but skis and snowboard is ideal. So in this compartment, we have on one side um, our fresh water and waste drains. On the other side, we have our electrical. It's just a reminder that it's a 30 amp. So when you're booking your site, you definitely want to make sure it can accommodate 30 amps. And there's also an outdoor shower. Um, so in case you need to use that, it's very convenient. you on an overview of the interior of the RV. Here we have the storage closet with plenty of room for hanging your clothes. We have our bathroom vanity with a sink, storage underneath and up top. So here we have the main bedroom comfortably sleeps too. Overhead storage. Up top we stock the RVs with plenty of linens, blankets and pillows and as we talked about earlier, this is accessible to the storage compartment from the outside. Very spacious. And here you have your Norco fridge and freezer combination. This is seven cubic feet. It's 52 inches tall, 23 inch depth, and 23 inch width. So there should be plenty of room for your trip. Up top is the main control panel, and we'll get to this in to more detail, but this is basically where your inverter, your water pumps, your water heaters, your tank levels, your inverter controls, your LP valve. I know there's a lot there, but we'll go into this in a lot more detail later. So 
here's our kitchen. Up above, we have a storage compartment. For all of our rentals, we provide the essentials. Coffee maker with filters, mugs, glasses. Down below, we have storage for our remotes. Fire starters, small tools. We provide plates, bowls, all your cooking utensils, pots, pans, strainers, and cutting board. We have our double sink. Down below, more storage with our trash, cleaning supplies. We provide soap, sponges, trash bags, paper towels. Up above, we have our television with a compartment behind. Storage compartment. Back here, we supply some videos. For families, we supply a Nintendo unit. We have a few cords back here, an extension cord if needed. We have an HDMI cable with an Apple iPhone connection so you can stream off your phone or computer with the HDMI connection that plugs into the entertainment system. 